This important information is provided by Safe Sports Network, a nonprofit dedicated to youth sports safety. With a person with type 1 diabetes, the body is not able to produce insulin. This type requires careful monitoring and injection of insulin into the body to maintain proper blood sugar levels. In type 2 diabetes, the body can make some insulin, but either doesn't make enough of it or it doesn't use it properly. An athlete has greater energy demands than a person at rest. He or she uses glucose faster blood sugar drops quicker. When blood sugar levels become too high or too low, the athlete can become shaky, vision can blur, speech may become slurred, or he or she can be appeared lethargic or out of it. Thus, blood sugars must be monitored much more closely to prevent sudden drops or spikes in blood sugar levels. Type 1 diabetes requires careful daily maintenance of blood sugar levels. Insulin is injected into the person to bring sugar into the body's cells either if the blood sugar level is too high and or after eating a snack or meal. Sugary snacks like orange juice, cookies, or even glucose tabs can be used to briefly elevate blood sugars when the levels drop too far. Athletes are often able to recognize when they are feeling hypoglycemic and should immediately test their sugar levels if they are feeling any symptoms. Some athletes have automatic pumps that constantly measure blood sugar levels and pump in insulin directly to the body. Type 2 diabetes is treated and managed through periodic testing, diet modification, and medication. A person with uncontrolled or undiagnosed diabetes can display any of these signs, excessive thirst, frequent urination, extreme hunger, blurry vision, weight loss despite eating more, and slurring speech. If you or your child have any of these symptoms, contact your doctor to be evaluated. Long-term uncontrolled diabetes causes significant damage to your body tissues. For example, blindness is one of several possible long-term effects of unhealthy sugar levels. The earlier diabetes is diagnosed, the easier it is to learn how to manage blood sugar levels and therefore stave off these long-term side effects of diabetes. The National Athletic Trainers Association has created a management plan specifically for athletes. It includes strategies to help keep athletes with type 1 diabetes safe. These include what to pack to do testing on the sideline, what to pack when traveling to away games, and what signs and symptoms to watch for when blood sugars get too high or too low. To learn more about diabetes, make sure to check out the links below. And make sure to visit our website at www.safesportsnetwork.org. Thank you.